it's, it's an honor to share this stage uh, with Sharik, uh, Tamea, uh, obviously Dave Robinson, and Michael. Um, I heard the young people speak, they did an outstanding job. And we've got our work cut out for us, guys, so you better prepare something. <laughs> but uh, this journey for me is kind of uh, an example of when things come full circle. My grandpa uh, grew up in uh, Kenosha. He played uh, football with Alan Amici in high school. And my dad grew up here, too, until second grade. So my whole childhood, I've been coming through, stopping at Uncle Ralph's. Uh, you know, I've been in Kenosha here and there for 20 plus years now, so it's really neat to come back and uh, I don't know how much longer I'll be in Wisconsin. I know some of which I'll go back, which would be great, Woo! but uh, <laughs> yeah. it's a great chance to be back in Kenosha. Uh, always incredible people, very friendly, and uh, just thank you so much for having me. On top of that, I want to specifically thank the Holy Rosary, Rosary Committee uh, for allowing me to share the stage with uh, so many impressive people. And, uh, if you've seen the history of this event, which anything going on for 60 plus years is, is something special, uh, there's been names like Bart Starr, uh, Jerry Kramer, um, and the list goes on and on and on. And each one's more impressive than the next. To, to be on that list in some way uh, is an absolute honor, and I'm thankful for it. Um, as far as my story, it's somewhat unique. I wasn't a very highly recruited player. Uh, I could have used my height, that would have been nice to have. Uh, <laughs> same with Mr. Robinson. I'm a little vertically challenged, so offers didn't come my way. I didn't have a hat ceremony on signing day. Uh, I didn't have my final five. I had one offer, and it was Wisconsin. And it all worked out for the best because that was where I wanted to go. That's where my grandfather went. My dad grew up partially in Kenosha, partially in Madison, so we were Badger fans. Um, and I don't know if things happened for a reason, but I'm sure glad it turned out the way it did. Um, the last four or five years have been uh, beyond my wildest dreams. Like Telly was telling you about how people laughed at him when he said he wanted to be on TV. People laughed at me when five years ago when I said I wanted to play Division I football. Um, and now the same people that are watching me on TV on Saturdays. So um, it, things tend to work out for those who work hard and, and have faith, um, which I've had the good fortune of having. So um, that's where I am right now. I've, I've completed my degree. I graduated in December and I'm currently preparing for the NFL. Um, and I, I was talking to Michael, and I had a question for you guys. He was saying Kenosha is a Packers town, but I see an Erlacher jersey, I see a, a Bears hat. Is it a Bears town or is it a Packers town? Um, I'm going to continue to try to do that. I don't know where my life's going to take me, but um, 
you know, I wouldn't stick to that philosophy. I think Chris Gillen was exactly right. So thank you for your time, and thanks for letting me be a part of this special event.